for stopping by to watch this video. I appreciate it very much that you want to watch my video. So thank you for that. Today I have an art supply haul. I already did a coloring book haul. And now I want to show you what for art supplies that I bought in the last couple of months. So let's start, start with the first thing. And let's start with this roll. This roll I also bought. <laughs> but it's about the color pencils inside. That is this lovely colors. They are pastel color pencils. I don't didn't have any pastel pencils, so I want to try them out. Um, I don't have the case anymore, but they are from the Brutfuner color pencils, and um, they do have names. I hope you can see it. And uh, a name of the color on the pen, and I li really like that the numbers are on the end of the pencil. I hope you can see it. I'm not certain, but <laughs> you have to trust me. They are numbers. <laughs> and I have already swatched out the colors. And this is the colors in this set. I really like the colors in this set. And uh, I'm not certain how they color in my coloring book. On the paper they were fine. So I have to test them out, but at least you know which color you can find in this test. I thought they were uh, uh, from Macron or so, something like that. I'm not certain, but I bought them on Amazon. And when you uh, type in pastel brute thunder, um, I think you can find it. This is um, how many color pencils? I think there are. Uh, I'm not certain how many. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> 50. 50 pencils. <laughs> 50 color pencils because this uh, pencil roll is for 84. So I put the last two at this pocket. That They are a little bit loose. But uh, otherwise they fit all in this uh, roll. I really like it because you can roll it up like this. Put down the rope like this, and you put it in here, and you have them all nice and compact. So I really like it, nice like this. Uh, the next thing up, oh, that's not really an art supplies, but I do use it in my coloring books. They are magnet uh, page. <laughs> I'm not certain how they call, but you can put it on your page. <laughs> so if I finish a page, I can put it on, and when I'm showing you to you, I know which page I have to show. It's also I wanted to use less paper, um, so I think this is a little bit durable, a little bit um, environmentally friendly, I think, <laughs> because I throw a little bit. Not, not so much paper away <laughs> and this is 90, 90 of this they were a pack of 30 I think and sometimes I have 30 pages but sometimes I do have 60 and sometimes I have more of over 60 so I thought by myself I buy 90 then I'm safe <laughs> But I certainly have enough, and maybe they will break um, sometime, I think, I don't know. <laughs> and the next one is this one, this is the hoo hoo hoo. This is also the pastel set. In this set you get also a sheet, that you can do uh, behind your page to for the true, that uh, it does not bleed through. I'm not using them quite often, only in my small coloring books, because they are a little bit too small. Most of my coloring books are a little bit bigger. Look, this is my regular book size, and this is a small. I hope they make uh, something like this, but a little bit bigger, because this is a nice, nice uh, sheet to put between your pages. And 
they are also pastel this is a pastel set there are 48 colors and i already swatched them out already didn't use them so i don't know uh, how they use in my coloring book but if they are like the other who set that i have then they are fine i love my who who markers and uh, and this would be a nice um, uh, thing to have the nest uh, <laughs> beneath my uh, set that i have now i have now the 200 set i will get it no sorry for the noise <laughs> Something fell, <laughs> and that is this set. There are different colors in that I don't have in this set, so that is nice to have this. And I also bought me a new set of 200. They were in a uh, very nice sale, so I bought myself a backup. So this is also for this <laughs> coloring haul, but I'm not going to show you. They are still in the box. Um, I'm using up first this set, but if I run out of some of the colors, I know I have a backup. And this is also an alcohol marker that I'm going to keep. And... Um, Every time it's running out, uh, I will buy it again because I really like the who who alcohol markers. But that is my opinion. You have, may have a, a different opinion. Maybe uh, some other alcohol markers work, work better for you. Um, but that you have to find out yourself. Uh, yeah, because we are all different and we all like different things. But I'm very happy to have the pastel set because they have much softer colors than in the regular set. So. Yeah, I'm very happy and I I uh I'm really gonna enjoy playing with them. <coughs> and I keep them in this nice case. They have new, they do have nice cases the Uhus. So now I put it later back. <laughs> Otherwise I'm struggling. And that's not why you're here. Uh, the next thing is uh, is from Artsy Glitter Salt Watercolor. Uh, this is a 48 set. I wanted to use some more watercolor next year. And uh, also some more glitter or metallic like. So I bought me this set um, to fill it on. And this is the colors you can find in this set. And this is the card that they came in. And it is a very nice box. Uh, where you see this very steady and it came in this nice row and this is the box that they are in I really like how they package this <laughs> and this is the inside <laughs> and this is how you open it and here you can mix your colors it's nice that it is in one tin and at the other side also and this is the colors this is not the brush that they came with this is my brush <laughs> this is my pencil <laughs> I still uh, let them in um, I already packed them out they came in a nice wrap um, it was a little bit hard to get them out and get them in again but I managed <laughs> And I also swatched them out, so I'm going to show you the colors that you can find in this set. And it is pretty beautiful. You can see all the shininess. I really like this set. And didn't use them yet. Maybe for next year, because I'm <laughs> busy with the 10 box to finish. Maybe I will use it out at one of the pages in the coloring book. I have a page with unicorn. Maybe I will... Uh, give them a try on that page but uh, I'm certainly going to use it next year because I really like the colors in the set some of them are very very special or something uh, not special but uh, grabs me more like wow that's a beautiful color <laughs> I hope you can see it so 
so uh, I'm very happy to have this too and uh, I'm certainly gonna enjoy it <laughs> using it and it is very nice that it comes in a, in a nice steady case I will wrap it again in <laughs> I like the color too of the tin The next two are the Pentel Hybrid 2 Metallic, the gold and the silver one. I bought myself a big package because these are the last two pens that I have. I use them quite a lot. <laughs> I think I used already three pens this year. Yeah. <laughs> and I buy them uh, every time single or buy two so I thought now I buy a 12 pack <laughs> I'm going through them quite a lot and they were cheaper than to buy them separate so uh, and they were in sale too so that's uh, the reason why I bought myself a 12 pack and <laughs> I know I'm gonna use them because I really really like them gonna show you they call the hybrid dual metallic k 110 this is the silver one oh. silver And this is the gold. I really like the gold and the silver one. So I hope you can see it. They are very glittery. It's also a little bit because I have light <laughs> above. <laughs> but uh, they do work quite nice in every color book that I use in so this is a keeper <laughs> that you can see because I bought me a self a 12 pack <laughs> so uh, I think I can last <laughs> at least I hope a year <laughs> but we will see how many <laughs> I will use up but uh, yeah I bought this also on Amazon very happy to have it the next one is also something I already have but is running low. Some of them are quite empty so I bought myself another set of Shakura Jelly Roll Stardust Glitter. Uh, I didn't open them not yet because they are not totally dry the one that I'm using up. So, but I can show you the colors in the set. I'm gonna swatch them out for you so that you can see <laughs> because the paper that <laughs> I have already swatched them out but the paper that I uh, have swatched them out they are uh, totally scribbled up with other color <laughs> with other glitter gel pen this is the darker one it's not uh, not black but it is also not gray it is in between there's something blue in it and this is orange and this is yellow I hope you don't hear the noises but they are talking outside of my window this is more red that could, for my taste it could be better than more red more popping red this is pink there is another color of pink, a darker pink those two I use also quite a lot and the next one is this one the purple <laughs> I really like the purple in this set and I'll 
some of the green. I really like, especially this one, <laughs> because I use this one a little bit more than that one. And then we got the blues. <clears throat> I think there are 12 colors. Yes, there are 12 colors in this pack. And I like the blues also in this set, especially that one and this one. And this is the darker blue. But these are the colors in this set. Ain't they gorgeous? I really like it so that is why I bought them again <laughs> I only buy them again when I'm very um, content with them if they really do uh, what I do want them to do I don't know to say that right but I hope you know what I mean uh, I will put this aside later <laughs> And then we have already the last item to show you. Yes, it is of course another alcohol marker set. But this is a small set. This is a 72 set. This is some set that I can take when I'm going somewhere or, or traveling or something like that. Uh, and they are also... Oh. They do have a nice study uh, container down in the back so that they don't fall off but they are the smaller uh, alcohol markers that's the Mel Lee Flow art markers and uh, I already used them in some coloring books and I'm very um, content with them too this is uh, the brush nib this that's the brush but this is just a bullet nib or oh, not bullet nib but just a point the distant bullet nib oh they do smell <laughs> I'm getting a scent of them now in my nose <laughs> and I swatched them also out for you so that you can see the colors and this is the colors in this set I really like that there are quite some different uh, colors of green <laughs> I use up my green more than every color in the set so I'm very happy to have more greens in my set so uh, <laughs> and um, it is quite com some completed set there are a lack of little bit of lack, lack, lacking in skin tones there's only one yeah the brown you can also use for skin tones there's not a whole lot of browns in this set too but for for a traveling set or uh, just one day set it's fine uh, and I do have more alcohol markers so <laughs> if I don't get can get it in this set I will pick another set that does have the color but if I want to go away for a day this is a nice set to grab myself and uh, yeah I'm not certain if they do yellow or not yellow um, I didn't see in my coloring book yet but for so far I know they don't yellow but uh, don't <laughs> take my word on it <laughs> just test it out it yourself um, what else can I say about these old well markers um, like the color nice they are nice and juicy I didn't have any problem with lay with swatching they did all uh, what they had to do and yeah <laughs> that is all that I have to show you today <laughs> um, so I want to thank you for watching this video and I hope you enjoyed it if you enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up and when you see want to see more of my coloring journey Please subscribe to my channel and I wish I wish you a very nice day, evening, whenever you watch this video and uh, till next time. Bye bye.